Hi guys, I have um, a question of user. Just made you guys a video of how to change your beautiful Arctic Link Simplicity wallpaper or background into something you like because there are trillions of wallpapers. And if I wait for the login, which is automatically always on my end, first of all, I do a right control F and a right control F again because of the VM SVGA. And if we log out, we have this beautiful uh, choice that came from Wallhaven with a variety. That's another video. I want to talk you through to the facts of the test it again. Basically, somebody says I have i3 and I want to switch the bar of i3 to polybar, right? Shouldn't be difficult and all the tutorials are there already, but things can go wrong updates right so it's never good uh, never a bad idea so it's a good idea to test it and in the meantime i explain all kinds of things like the reference to sdm take a nice wallpaper and put it there and you'll be happier for it when you're greeted with your well favorite wallpaper so i need i3 how easy is it to install i3 well like that i3 is installed done and you go log out okay log out and we go to i3 i3 so nothing there no problems here don't really like the conky being there but in the beginning and i understand that you need all these key bindings and you need to know a few things on the tiling window manager so repeating is learning we have Control alt enter so we have a terminal. We need to have a terminal somehow. There's also super T that might be a terminal, but not in this case, right? So in BSP also there are different um, tiny window managers. Here it's a tap. Do you see this blue thing up there? We have um, super enter, which is one that works here as well. Um, what else? There is super shift enter, which we need. It's file manager, a little bit smaller, might be the trick. So what am I doing? Control scroll the mouse right this is good Control h i don't want to see the hidden files Control h i want to see the hidden files okay don't need to remember it if you know where it is show hidden files Control h now quitting stuff is important so super q a super q a super q gets uh, kills things right but there's also Control alt t super shift q the con key, uh, sometimes uh, people are new, right? And then how do I get rid of the con key? Super simple, super C. The C stands for con key. Now that's the introduction con key. If I press again, super C, then it's the session, then, then it's another con key as you see, right? So it's it's gonna be different on any desktops and we have like 30 plus desktops. So it will show differently. It's not, it has this, this marker, this, this border, right? Now, it's the way it is because we're an i3 it's enough take a look how hot is he or how this or how that and then super c by it's no need to have conkeys inside a tiling generation but i get that you want to quickly see what's he doing okay x or conky is doing yeah fine okay bye right that's that i need to go to the poly bar need to test if this is working how do i test it well we use the Control alt e another key binding. Uh, well, actually, I forgot to tell you a few. Super D is one you need to know as well. And Super Shift D is one you need to know. So you can launch software, right? And the Super X to log out and look and so on. Then you know all the important key bindings. And now we go to Control alt e the tweak tool gets launched and there is a tab concerning i3 there is a themer and they only get active when you install awesome or left wm or qtile they're not active but if it finds the application i3 then it says oh let's toggle the polybar right and then let's have a look if we do super shift R, it's immediately applied. 
as you see. But what I would do is actually apply it, well, do a logout. As a general rule, I want to just say that as a general rule, it sometimes pays off to log out, log in, or even reboot and restart, right? But as you see, there is no issue with the polybar. And now we can report back that uh, everything is fine, right? Everything is fine. What I'm doing now is super shift R. So sometimes the icons are not loaded or something is not okay. Super shift R is in many of our tiling window managers, a reboot kind of thing, right? So reload kind of thing better, not reboot, reload of the particular um, tiling window manager. All right, that's it for me. Polybar check works. Cheers.